Good morning, everyone. This is the outfit for the closed door interview. And I did my own makeup again. I hope it's okay. <laughs> uh, and I did my own hair, obviously. Hola, uh, I have to hurry. Um, changing. I have to hurry because, yeah, I need to eat breakfast. And our call time is at 8.15 and it's 8. And, um, yeah, I don't have lipstick yet. Um, there we go, the elevator. Okay, so if you can see, I brought my stuff. Oh, I need to press something. Uh, ground floor. <laughs> I was able to go back to the room because I really needed to poop. Uh, you know, just that amazing feeling after you take a really good dump. I'm good for today. <laughs> We're done with rehearsals and, um, well, I'm really tired. <laughs> I just had too many carbs today. Choco Java chip, Starbucks. Dude, I really don't drink that stuff, so I am not used to that at all. And then I had a butterscotch brownie during lunch, and then I had a brownie during dinner along with lasagna and what else i had a banana i can't remember what else i had it's just i'm really not used to that i'm really not i'm really not used to the sugar crash the sugar rush and everything so Hi guys, Kim Velasco. <laughs> I'm her roommate. My buddy. <laughs> My buddy. Sh feeling shitty um, due to all of the sugar. I'm really not used to. So that's why I'm having tea now. Um, we had the closed door interview today and then rehearsal straight after. I'm so tired from rehearsals. And yeah, I'm just. I'm tired. <laughs> and we still have rehearsals tomorrow plus we have to be pretty because GMA is gonna come and film our rehearsals so <laughs> good night guys believe me I need to keep myself alive but I don't need to kiss you hey we can make it tonight baby that's just fine don't know what I'm doing Feel like I am going crazy Keep it down Good morning guys uh, Hey, look, I'm vlogging <laughs> Now I just um, Remember how last night uh, Wait, my brain <laughs> Wait, wait, wait Okay, so Remember how last night, uh, I mean yesterday, I just had like a day just full of sugar and carbs and I'm really not used to it so still not feeling 100% this morning and I'm just gonna go for a run on a treadmill. Interval running maybe for like 10-15 minutes or something before breakfast. Yeah, that's it. I can tell you're soaking up all of it now. No, I can't see my abs. I need a light. Okay, they're there. Yep, they're there. Okay. I gotta go eat breakfast before the ghost release. Bye. Yeah, 
yeah, we just I was I was running in the gym and then I finished 15 minutes and then I was just about to start abs and we were chatted that we have a photo shoot in the hotel so we had to like put our makeup on quick quick put a dress on and everything and I was able to still get some breakfast in at least some fruits and egg and pancit and arroz caldo and chicken and fish and almonds <laughs> that's a lot yeah but you know it's a breakfast buffet bro we're gonna go practice uh, right. I know this issue because we're gonna go have rehearsals at the AFB theater because the event is tomorrow already yeah I still couldn't sleep last night so I had to take melatonin I think I slept well but then my roommate's alarm I wake up from her alarm and not her <laughs> so yeah, I'm just waiting for a bit so that we can go down together and there we go Kim Velasco Okay, let's go, let's go. Let's go.
I am Luis Cienes, 21 years old, representing Carascal Surigao del Sur. I graduated Magna Cum Laude, rank top 1 in the pharmacist licensure exam, and I'm currently taking my master's degree at University de Santo Tomas in hopes of achieving my PhD someday. I love the gym and I love food, and as a YouTuber and social media influencer, I hope to share my passion with other people to inspire them to keep healthy and disciplined and to love themselves. I ain't got no money for living. I ain't forgiving of what you've done. I ain't got no reason for thinking. I'm just doing what I've always done. I ain't got no money for living. I ain't forgiving of what you've done. I ain't got no reason for thinking. I'm just doing what I've always done. I'm gonna take you down. I'm gonna take you where you don't know where you are anymore. I will take you. I'm gonna take you down. I'm gonna take you where you don't know where you are anymore. Your question. Some feminists are still not convinced that beauty pageants are created to empower women. What can you say to them? Thank you for that question. To the feminists who still don't believe in beauty pageants for wi women empowerment, I would say look at the girls in front of you. We are a bunch of intellectual girls. There are pharmacists, there are teachers, there are athletes. There are girls of many different talents here. And it's not just about our beautiful faces or our long legs. It's about how we bring ourselves to the stage, how we bring our stories, how we share our journeys with the other people. And I don't believe that's degrading at all. I believe that's empowering because we share our passion and we share who we are on stage with confidence. We believe that we are beautiful, strong, and we believe that we are healthy on the inside and out. Thank you. Thank you so much, our first finalist, Healthy Inside and Out. Our Miss Bikini Philippines 2019, second runner up is finalist number 13. Miss Bikini Philippines 2019 first runner up is 11 Roberta Angela Condom. Miss Bikini Philippines 2019 is Canada number number four. Okay, shampoo the one. You know, duties. Duties. It's 2 a.m., but we have to attend the party because, like, duties. Oh. Uh -uh. She wants attention. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I'm feeling so dizzy. I'm finally going home, you guys. Like my voice is so broken from this party, and I look, I look horrible, and I still have class late later today. Yeah, six to nine. So I'm just gonna stay up the whole day and um, yeah, work on my school stuff. I really had fun with the girls, and I'm gonna miss them all. Oh, my voice is so bad. But yeah, I love them all. It was a wonderful experience. And I'm gonna die in the car, probably. Bye. Aww, she's so cute.